Yo, I want to welcome all y'all to the best Madden 19 tips and trips channel where you will be able to dominate on offense, send the fast blitzes on defense, make your opponent rage quit and send you nasty messages or either beg for you to quit out the game. I also do custom schemes if you play regs, so hit your boy up, follow the link in the description to get all the ebooks and you will become an exclusive member. Welcome to the Clamp Squad. What's up gamers? Welcome back to another Madden 19 video. Today you're gonna get a little insight on my offensive technique and a little bit of my defensive technique. If y'all enjoy the video, make sure you drop a like on the video. I appreciate that very much. And let's get this channel up and growing. So we coming out on defense right now and it looks like he's in a five wide with a scrambler so we're gonna play right here in the middle I'm trying to chuck it down the field and we got it all locked up now Damasu he comes right out in five wide second and 20 coming up so sticks now let him run he come a comeback route I'm right here oh man they gave me a wacky animation right there I seen him cutting back. I tried to jump the route. So a fourth and four comes up. He said that he's going to punt the ball. Going to make sure the running back can't come out. The backfield. We're going to contain on that on that side. And we get the user lurk. Had the contain over there to make sure he can't scramble to give himself more time. So now we're going to come out in our single back bunch. We're gonna put a draw, we're gonna put a pitch, and then we're gonna put a tight end angle over there. So we got three different plays that we can do. All this in this red zone, you can do on the fly. So right now we're just gonna test and see if he has auto flip on or not. So if they follow him, it's auto flip, okay. So we're gonna fake hike, and we setting up a pitch the whole time. All we gotta do is one or two spin moves. We don't even have to do that. We walk into the end zone, he got his guys spread out and he's planning on playing a lot of people in coverage. So all I want to do is watch a double roll, anything like that. Don't give him time. He throws it right to me because of the initial pressure off of that left side. That initial pressure off that left side forced him to have a cloudy judgment and he throws it right into my user. So if y'all want these setups to these, make sure y'all let me know. So it looks like he's coming out in a man coverage. Okay, he looks like he changed into a cover three. So we got that streak over there. I'm gonna motion this running back to this side so he can get that one on one uh, rope. And then we should be able to just throw it to the outside. I see he gets the separation. Easy touchdown. Never press against my offense. So there he is down to the four yard line. Burns a timeout. He can't stop me on offense, so I don't care about how much time he wastes trying to get into the end zone so he goes on to three wide so high point pass right there contains on the end stop that running back I don't care if he throws that but he throws a pick anyway and now we about to get a pick six and he gonna pull the core you ain't catching me you ain't catching me he caught me verticals but we gonna put our uh, tight end in the high point and we want him to chase this route over here. High point. He comes down with it in the back of the end zone. High point cheese, man coverage. It wasn't cover three, it wasn't cover two, but because he got that positioning, once I high point it and he turned facing the ball, they make it seem like the defender is not facing the ball, so he can't react as good, and we get the high point cheese. And we're gonna hit RB with the high point cheese, and we're gonna motion him over. So we're going to be looking for X for the high point cheese, then RB. So there he is with the double move. There's the high point cheese. Now he's behind me. We can go in for the touchdown. And we go up 28 to 0. 28 to 0. Defense been playing like down. If y'all want to be able to play just like this, make the correct reads, make the correct adjustments. 
Know when the person is sending heavy blitzes. Know when the person is letting up the gas and trying to force you to throw it into coverage. Because that's all that Madden is really about. Madden is really about if they can't stop your offense, they will give up and hope for the best. And when I say that, that means put two spies on the field, have eight in coverage. He's going to pitch it. He's going to run it. He's going to go underneath. He thinks that's open. That's not open. He's running with that guy. He's going to get big hit. He throws it. We get a pick. Six. He throws it across the field. We're going to spin on him. Spin on him. Let our blocks line up. We're going to take our run into the races right there. We get a pick six with the penalty in front of it. We're going to decline that and go up 34 to zero. So we manning up both of these safeties. I trust my cornerbacks. We're going to blitz right there. We're going to bring him outside. Any kind of any kind of drag and the pressure gets to my opponent. We're gonna do the same thing, but only on one side. We're gonna bring our guy out. We watching whoever jump down first underneath, and then that road on the right has to take a long time to develop. So this time we're gonna hover. He blocks that guy. I don't care about the route that's going on the other side. And the pressure gets to him once again. I'm telling y'all, if y'all want what you see in front of you, make sure you hit that subscribe button and make sure you email me. I will hook y'all up. So, right here, we're just going to play some coverage. We're going to move outside because he's motioning so he don't get that disadvantage against us right there. And we come down with another sack. Nothing special that we did. All about the setups, man. It's all about the setups. You gotta watch them outside when they get like this. Gotta watch them outside. There he is looping. We got all this. He tries to throw it to them outside. Like I told y'all, can he stand on his feet? He does. And we get another pick. Six. If y'all want the setups and the breakdowns that I have just released to all my donation supporters make sure you email me I got an offensive scheme a defensive scheme I did a big nickel out of the 5-2 I run some 4-3 I my setups is different than anybody else on YouTube I got y'all let's go